Studio Laveau. The salon is the business. How long have you guys been in Tremont? Uh, almost five years. This fall will be five years. Chris Davidson. Chris Davidson and Alex Studio Laveau. Yes. So what, what is Cleveland fashion like nowadays? Um, you know, I think in Tremont, here where we get most of our business from, uh, I think most people go is a, a less is more. We do a lot of fun haircuts. If the females just want something that they can get up, style quickly, and head off to work. We get a lot of the a lot of girls that like the, the female mohawks. On the male side, Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little, um, a lot of guys are just going with uh, just the more classic gentleman's haircuts with a little bit of a twist, a little more, uh, a little more texture so when they're not at work they can uh, shake it up a little bit and uh, be a little looser with it. So yeah. wh why, why, should, why should people come here to get the female mohawk? Why should they? Yeah. So they can hang out with Ron and myself. We're, we're a lot of fun. So but you're capable of doing the whacked out here. Yes, yes, we are capable. We have the technology. <laughs> you can get your haircut anywhere, but really? it's going to be boring, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it's, the, it's the people in the atmosphere that make it to you love. Okay, Chris, tell us about the artwork here at Studio Lebeau. This is actually done with a, uh, by a girl I went to high school with named Samaritan Pond. Uh, and she actually did these two for us. Um, you can see the, the hair incorporated with the scissors being cut in this one, and then over here, um, she's got a blow dryer blowing all her hair up. That's a blow dryer? It is right here, yes. And uh, yeah, it was just very nice for her to do that. She's uh, involved in the neighborhood herself. I believe she has more art at, at the uh, Flying Monkey. Oh, cool. Um, What's her name again? Meredith Hahn. So, what does Black Art Cleveland mean to you? Um, the black art Cleveland means to me, um, it's like, it's like uh, most people think of Cleveland as, you know, as all the negative stuff, as the, you know, the mistake on the lake, you know, and all that stuff, but uh, to me, I lived in Cleveland all my life, and I never left, the reason is I, I really can't find a better place to live. It's affordable, I really believe it's a world-class city, we, we, we have uh, great arts and culture, and uh, cuisine's amazing, and uh, and hopefully people realize that uh, we're uh, heading forward in fashion as well uh, at the hair point. And yeah, for me. 